green collagen chlorophyll drink. Oh my gosh. I actually woke up at 7 a.m., don't know why, and then I woke up again at 8. I just got I just got these new bar stools. Look, they're so cute. Hey. Yep, you guessed it. We're going to a cycling class this morning. One thing about Kiki is that if she finds leather, she will tear it up. interrupt this jam sesh to do this and I've talked about this on my channel before but if you've never heard me talk about it or do it we're doing it right now get ready for your life to be changed so you write today is a beautiful day so I like to start my day off by writing three things I'm grateful for the Sun my career transportation because how lucky am I to be able to just go to a cycling class? I have a car, so I don't have to walk there. And then you write three positive affirmations. I am strong and healthy, happy, and I am capable. I'm sending love to my future friends and family, those in need. And then you write three goals for your day. So like you could have 14 things to do, but out of those three, what are the most important that you absolutely need to get done? Hi, geeks. And then I write my plan for the day. And now you have a full sheet of a beautiful, great, amazing, awesome day. It's great. I love Celsius, but apparently it weakens your enamel. Your teeth get like weaker the more you drink it. So be careful. Hi. It's giving ghost. I look like a ghost. Let's go. Open sesame. <sighs> okay, we just got here. We, you and I. class 10 out of 10 so fun hi so sorry to interrupt but i just wanted to thank the sponsor of today's video thread up you guys know how much i love thrifting thread up makes it so that you can thrift online so you get one of a kind pieces and you're shopping sustainably fun fact every time i wear something secondhand i save enough water to make 74 matcha lattes that's a lot of matcha lattes they're also so reasonably plight pr and they're also so reasonably priced. The way that I like to shop on ThreadUp is I'll search a bunch of different brands that I love. So I search Free People, Juicy Couture, Betsy Johnson. And then I also just search for specific pieces that I wanna add to my wardrobe. What I like to do is I heart all of the things that catch my eye. And then I'll go through all of my liked clothes and I'll choose which ones to add to my cart. ThreadUp knows what they're doing. Okay, let me show you everything that I got. First, we have this Juicy Couture graphic tee. A, so comfy. B, so cute and see a little controversial because it is so long. I posted a TikTok wearing this and I pulled it all the way down. People were mad. This is very, very Y2K. Juicy couture for nice girls who like stuff. Like that's so funny. I love it. Okay, now let me show you the next piece. These free people jeans, they were originally 98 dollars and i got them for 31.99 i feel like they're like the perfect summertime jean could literally do yoga in these oh my gosh wait 10 out of 10. this white skirt is one of my favorite pieces that i found i think i'm gonna wear it out tonight it's cinco de mayo but like a fun little dancing skirt this is gap obviously i would not wear it with this top but okay so this is pro <laughs> i have been on the hunt for a good denim vest i feel like it has potential to be really really cute it needs to be styled well this is fun fun and good and nice i've been looking for some fun graphic tees. Can someone please tell me like what team this is? I kind of want to DIY this and make it into like a single shoulder tank top situation. And I've been looking for some white shorts and I found these. They're so, so comfortable. They're the brand Can Can. I feel like they'd be really good festival shorts. Okay, now this last piece. Look at the back, watch me spin like a summer concert or like maybe a date does anyone want to take me to a nice dinner i'll wear this 
Betsy Johnson is a designer brand. Her pieces are not cheap. Oh, but guess what? I got this dress for $23.99. Yeah. So if you want to add some fun pieces to your spring summer wardrobe, use my link right down there. Shop my picks. Use my code SUMMER. It'll get you an extra 35% off on top of the amount of money that you're already saving shopping secondhand. Thank you so much again, ThreadUp, for sponsoring this video. Okay, thank you. Hope you enjoy the rest of the video. The reason I love going to cycling classes so much is because it's so fun. If you're working out, you're getting fit. It might as well be fun, you know? Normally, I feel like absolutely dead and obliterated, but I feel good. And I am gonna go grocery shopping now, which is not very entertaining. This is what I look like coming back from Trader Joe's. Yay. morning i have been having crazy dreams Ugh. and i'm honestly like so sick of it because they always involve real people in my life and like real events and themes throughout my day like i'm fine but when i go to sleep my dreams remind me that maybe i'm stressed maybe i'm anxious what if this happens what if this happens i'm so sick of it i'm so sick of it and i remember my dreams every single morning how do i make that stop anyway today we're going to hot yoga it's 8 55 my class starts in 35 minutes hopefully yoga is rejuvenating and cleansing hopefully i can move my body through this like weird stress and anxiety oh tv i think this top is from glassons and these little shorts are from outdoor voices i'm doing my morning page i am strong and healthy i am happy i am full of energy and light okay hi Isn't it so weird how I've converted to Stanley? Am I conforming? Maybe. Okay, time to go. That was insane. Drenched in sweat. It was humid and it was hot. And so I was literally, I was like severely dripping the whole time. I'm seriously pruny. Like that's how wet I was the whole time. That's crazy. Yoga in general is just so good for your mind as well as your body because you're intentionally breathing. You're like connecting with your body in a way that like no other movement does. So I really, really like it and I feel like it did help with my stress and anxiety, which is amazing. That was exactly what I needed to do. I'm so happy that I did that. I had to get those clothes off of my body and I wanted to jump right into the shower, but I wanna make a smoothie before I get in the shower. I'm wearing a robe and it's awesome. And Comfortable. Look what I did. Isn't this just amazing? My blackberries, my strawberries, best thing ever. Kiki. So I've got some frozen bananas, four chunks of bananas, very cherry berry blend. Not that much. Kiki, please get down. Kiki. Okay. Well, Kiki wants to watch. And then I'm gonna put some. Some organic spinach because it's hard for me to get my greens in like I do make a really good like salmon arugula salad But so much easier to just blend up your greens and get them in that way now I'm putting a little bit of mixed baby kale in total of like a handful of greens and you barely taste it too And then we have a cranberry vanilla protein shake mix and this actually tastes so good I've used this for years it's my favorite some almond milk, almond milk. That might've been too much. And now we blend it up. That's actually so good. Mm-hmm, mm, mm, mm. Maybe these are kind of nostalgic for me because my sweet, sweet mother used to make a smoothie for me like every single day while I was getting ready for school. And she'd bring it up to my room and I would drink it while I got ready for school. Sometimes she'd make me waffles too. So a smoothie is like my whole childhood.
morning. It's 9.25. I'm gonna go walk outside at a park. Actually, I was gonna go work out in my gym, but today is the nicest day that we'll have for like the next week. So I wanna take advantage of it. I'm feeling better today than I felt yesterday waking up. I feel fine. I'm good. I started my period yesterday and that's why I was like tweaking because my hormones, I mean everyone's hormones when they're on their period gets crazy, but like I was actually diagnosed with PMDD, premenstrual dysphoric disorder. You can look it up, but essentially my PMS is like crazy. <laughs> and I think that's what was happening to me. So it definitely gave me clarity actually getting my period because I was like, oh, that's why I feel like I'm living in a simulation. Okay, let's do a workout outfit of the day. The zip up Lululemon. Under it I'm wearing <laughs> This thing is from Story. It's like a sports bra type situation. These leggings are so nice and thick and they're from Tavi, T-A-V-I, I think. And I'm wearing my Hoka's. This was me yesterday in hot yoga. I really like this. Like, yes, I can finally put that skill to use. Cause I always be doing this. And I be doing this too. Like that's a crazy. It's a crazy thing, it's a crazy move. I hope you're enjoying this video so far. If you want me to keep doing these, actually let me know. Hey team, I just got here. I literally, I am serving mother of three or four. There's a pond right here and it is so high. It's so cool actually. And then to my right, we have another pond. This is normally like a little creek, but it's like fully flooded and it goes all the way into the grass, I'll show you. But it's kind of fun to look at. Kind of fun. Utah's very dry. Maybe it needs some flooding. I'm drinking lemon lime Celsius. I think this is my favorite flavor. Look at the trees. And then it goes all the way over there into the grass and the ducks are loving it. I'm walking and I'm walking and I'm walking in. It's like room temperature. Don't look at me. It is cloudy, but it's not cold. It's windy, but it's not cold. There's really just not much to say. I'm just on a walk, looking like a mom. Timony, James, and Christina are all at home taking their naps. They do have the nanny over, so not to worry. They're in good hands. Okay, I just walked for like an hour and then I ran the last little part. It was really good and now the sun is out. Today has been a very good day so far and it's gonna keep getting better. I wanna believe that so bad. <sighs> See you soon. Kiki, what are you doing? Yum yum delish. And what really is the expiration on this? Let's talk about that. I like a lot of blueberries, some blackberries, and I already put strawberries. I really like making this after a workout because you've got your protein in there and it's really satiating because of the oats and the chia seeds and the hemp seeds and it tastes so good and you're also getting antioxidants from all the berries. There's gotta be benefits to Greek yogurt too, but I don't know. Greek yogurt is just delish. It tastes like a treat. It's so good. <laughs> Look what I just said. Yeah, it's funny because at this point I'm really just not even surprised. I'm not surprised that I've done something like that. I'm so, I'm awesome. I'm great to have around. I am, woo! Nothing can stop me from eating these blueberries. At least I recently swept and mopped my floor. <laughs> Okay, back in the kitchen. Brie came over and we did a bunch of podcast stuff. But I wanna show you what I'm making because I'm actually cooking. Like I'm cooking full meal. We'll see how it turns out. I'm starving. So I'm gonna make chicken, rice, veggies, and sweet potato fries. And I've been snacking on my strawberries. This is the kitchen. <laughs> Here's the chicken, um, Trader Joe's chicken. Snacking on these as well. I'm so hungry. We've got onions, peppers, and rice in here. Put some olive oil in with it. I'm making sweet potato fries in my air fryer. And I'm watching Love is Blind. This is my favorite show. I'm on season four. I've watched every season. First season's not good, in my opinion. So I put some baby kale in there because I thought that sounded good. And I'm gonna put the chicken, rice, and peppers on top of it. Yay! We've got the papas fritas. Sweet potato fries right here. And I'm gonna make some sauce. We're gonna do ranch and some buffalo sauce. There's my dinner. I'm so excited. Look at me making a meal. I'm also trying to 
empty my dishwasher. I am a full adult woman. Like sometimes I just have moments where I realize that. I'm like, wow, like I'm just like fully living by myself in my own apartment with my own cat making my own dinner using things that I bought myself at a grocery store. Weird. Weird, but awesome. I can't get a vibe on it. They're definitely crispy though. Why can I like not taste it? Let's try my chicken dinner. Mm-hmm, it's good. Call me crazy, but I'm gonna add some sriracha mayo. This tastes good on absolutely everything. Um, oh wow, I don't know why I did that. <laughs> That is delightful. I, mm. For my treat, I decided that I want a mango cream bar from Trader Joe's. These things are so good and I don't think they're out year round. I think they only come out in the springtime. Mm -hmm. It's like so fresh. It tastes like a fresh mango smoothie that you would get in Hawaii on the beach. Yummy. Not for Kiki. You wanna smell it? Yum, yum. Piki, I think they forgot to put cream in here. Whatever. I got to the cream. Oh my gosh, it's so good. That's the best part, Kiki. The sun hasn't even gone down. It's 7 p.m. <gasps> Girl, you're walking on thin ice. Yeah, you are so curious. It's inspiring. This has been fun. Kiki, now is just not the time, girlfriend. Use my link, shop my pics, use my code SUMMER. It'll get you an extra 35% off. Thank you so much again, ThreadUp, for sponsoring this video.